Hi friends, welcome back to my channel, SciTech. In this video, I'm going to do the benchmark test side by side comparison between the iQ9 SE device versus iQ Neo 6 device. Snapdragon 888 processor versus Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 processor. So this iQ Neo 6 which has got the Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 uh, model which I'm trying to use in this video. As you can see friends, this is iQ Neo 6 with the Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 and very soon I'll get hands on with the Snapdragon 870 as well. So stay tuned for those videos in case if you're interested. But right now let's focus on this one. Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 processor versus Snapdragon 888 processor. How much difference we're gonna expect between these both processors regarding the benchmarks? And how much high temperatures also we're gonna see between these both phones. So that's what I'm going to concentrate exactly in this video while performing this test. Right now I'm trying to use the same analog benchmark uh, as you can see 9.3.8 which I'm trying to use. So just now I did install the same analog benchmark version between these both phones. And while doing this kind of test, we'll try to concentrate on the temperatures, how much high temperatures the Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 can increase when comparing with the Snapdragon 8 processor. This is what uh, my main focus will be there in today's video. And let's get started friends without wasting any time and let me know in the comments what are the comparisons you want me to do between these both phones. And let's get started with the comparison regarding the benchmark test and regarding the heating test as well. Let's get started and no monster mode is used while performing this kind of testing. So that's something you should definitely understand about the testing, no monster mode is used. Without using monster mode, I'm going to do the test. So let's get started from. Right now, as you can see, we're getting close to the end of the benchmark test results. Snapdragon 888 processor versus Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 processor. So we're getting close to the end of the test results. And let's check the final temperatures, 36.8 degrees Celsius. Final temperatures, 37 degrees Celsius. And in the IQ Neo 6 with the Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 processor, 38.4 it's reaching as you can see not bad and i'll be back at the end of the benchmark test results so finally as you can see friends the final result regarding the benchmark test results iqo 9 se and iqo neo 6 device can definitely see a cpu and the gpu scores how much difference and overall score also 8 lakhs 30 versus 9 lakhs 99,000. and you can definitely see 4 lakhs 38 and 325 the gpu scores are really higher the cpu is not much higher but definitely the gpu is very high and memory score you can see what's going on with the memory score and look at the temperatures highest is 37 degrees celsius and the highest is 40 degrees celsius so definitely there is a difference of 3 degrees celsius difference is there between the snapdragon 88 processor and snapdragon 8 gen 1 processor regarding the temperatures wise this is a quick comparison friends between these both phones and in case if you're having any other doubts let me know in the comment section below so until then signing off friends thank you for watching a straight of more updates and i'll definitely come do a lot of comparison videos in the future. So stay tuned for those videos as well. Until then, signing off, friends. Thank you for watching, man. Bye.